If you've been convicted at court martial, it's important to have a second set of eyes by an attorney that was not involved in the lower court's proceeding. Oftentimes errors are committed, um, evidence sometimes is allowed in over objections. It's important for an experienced appellate attorney to review the record and see if there's viable issues on appeal that can overturn a conviction, send a conviction back for remand, potentially have you resentenced, potentially have the conviction overturned. Were there errors made by your defense attorney, potentially by the judge, was evidence allowed in that shouldn't have been allowed in. My last assignment in the Army JAG Corps was as a defense appellate attorney, where I reviewed transcripts and argued appeals. I wrote criminal appellate briefs and I argued criminal appeals before the Army Court of Criminal Appeals and also before the Court of Appeals of the Armed Forces. You need to have an experienced criminal appellate attorney review the case, review the transcript and see if errors were made see if there's any potential to have the case overturned. Did the government actually prove its case beyond a reasonable doubt? It's important to have an attorney spot those issues, write an appellate brief, and then argue it before an appellate court. The relief requested could be overturning your criminal appeal, could be resentencing to lower a sentence. It's very important to have an appellate attorney argue on your behalf to continue the fight. The fight is not over after you're convicted. You need to continue the appellate battle.